everyone, Joel Lance here, and for today's video, we're in Huntsville, Alabama. Yes, Huntsville, Alabama, at New South Hot Dogs. This is New South Hot Dogs, which is a food truck serving the Huntsville and surrounding area. So today we are doing their crazy new challenge. So this is a hot dog challenge featuring a large variety or literally their whole menu of hot dogs plus their sushi rolls. So literally like their whole menu. So it's like seven or eight massive hot dogs. We're talking quarter pound, quarter pound hot dogs. Yes, they use the quarter pounds and eighth hot dogs. Then they're absolutely topped dressed to the nines. And what's super cool is this restaurant really specializes in sushi and hot dog combinations. So super cool fusion food. So we're gonna have 20 minutes uh, to complete the challenge, and if not, we're facing about a $70 price tag. So anyway, let's tune in, let's have fun with these food. Uh, that's about it, so wish us luck, let's go eat. Should be a lot of fun. I've heard they're very, very delicious items. I'm super excited to try them all out. So with that, let's get eating. All right, so we're here with all the food. When we're here with Luis, Luis is going to walk us through all the items here. So, my friend, what do we have in front of us today? All right, man, we got a whole lot of good stuff here. Starting out with one of my favorites, the mojito dog. Mojito! Starts off always the uh, quarter pound Nathan's hot dog. Here we have some provolone cheese, our citrus aioli, topped off with a little bit of cilantro, some bacon stuffed in there too. Squeeze the lime for sure. And okay, accentuate add it. the lime, I got that. We got the uh, Carolina dog, simple. Got some chili cheese or chili with the slaw on top, a little bit of mustard drizzle. Then we got our my second favorite, the volcano dog. Packs a little bit of a punch with the heat. It looks like sushi roll. It does, man. That's what I'm saying. He it's comes cool. from a sushi background, so everything is kind of beautifully dressed, like really it. well done. Yeah. Ham picks, ham does everything before they come out. Then we got the classic. The chili cheese dog, probably one of our biggest sellers. That's but pretty, pretty American, right yeah, there. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta break out of the bun sometimes, though. Go with the Bama Big Dog right here, with around three ounces of the uh, pulled pork slaw, and then our spicy mayo. Also comes from the sushi background. I'll take it. Then we got our crunchy dog. It's got some pork rinds crunched on top, with a little bit of uh, what is it, fried onions, and then also avocado bacon in there. Nice. And our spicy mayo just on top. Classic Chicago. Do you love a Chicago dog? And then we go in hard with the surf and surf dog. Got a little bit of imitation crab meat up top and it pretty much looks like a sushi roll. It looks like a sushi roll actually. Like here, check this out. And then what do we got here? We got a sushi roll as well. Yeah, that's our crispy crab roll. Deep fried and just amazing. I like it. Hey, well, thank you so much. Appreciate that. And ultimately, let's get eating. So like we said, it does look really, really delicious. I'm super excited. Definitely unique hot dogs. Um, so how about we get started? While we got that, I'll put the, put the lime on the dog. The mojito dog. All right, guys. So 20 minutes. How do we get started? Let's say oh, I'll start with the Chicago dog. How do we say at the count of five, four, three, two, one? Let us eat. Very good. Huge hot dogs, though. I like that a lot. I'm trying this mojito dog. Looks good. Giant though. Damn! Dude, that's delicious. It's like creamy and that's 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 amazing. Damn. I'm a fan. We've got a volcano roll. This one might be a little spicy. Mmm. That sauce is super good as well. That like cupy mayo they're using that mayo, the jalapenos. That avocado is so rich as well, it's a really nice flavor. 
Hey everyone, welcome to this video. Today we are here at New South Hot Dogs. Yes, New South Hot Dogs in Huntsville, Alabama. And let me start by saying, a Nathan's hot dog. Oh my gosh. Honestly guys, I, these are probably the most exquisite, awesome, delicious hot dogs I've ever, ever had. I love a Nathan's hot dog. That is probably my favorite commercially available hot dog. So comment down below right now your favorite commercially available hot dog. Should I choose dog? So let's talk about the hot dogs here. So what the craziest thing, you know, fusion foods are very big and popular right now, but sushi kind of style hot dogs, oh my gosh, freaking awesome. I never knew that such a pairing could exist, and I never knew such a pairing could be so delicious and tasty. I tell you, using that like Nathan's hot dog makes such a difference. I love Nathan's hot dogs, they're such good quality, and they just taste fantastic. All beef chili as well, no bean tip. Just like, it's freaking good. So of course we had some more kind of traditional style dogs like the chili cheese dog. We had you know the Alabama you know with barbecue sauce etc. Um, you know pulled pork, um, the big one. But I gotta say, just you know having the imitation crab. We're talking those QP that spicy mayonnaise, the mojito dog. Oh my gosh, what an amazing flavor combination! Like literally life changing. We got the crispy dog. Got some pork rinds on it. Spicy mayo, cream cheese. The hot dogs we're using as well are the quarter pound Nathan's hot dogs. Again, guys, we're talking legit the most quality hot dog in my opinion. And a massive, massive hot dog. So big that these are not traditional like hot dog buns. They have to use like basically like a hoagie or almost like a small sub slash sandwich bun to house this. But the combination of that delicious bun with that delicious hot dog and all the toppings was absolutely exquisite. So when it came to the challenge itself, um, pretty straightforward. I mean, we had the hot dogs and then we had the one sushi roll. This one legit tastes like a sushi roll. We did have only 20 minutes to eat all of the food in order to get the meal for free. Um, but like I said, when it came to flavor and variety, I knew we were in for a heck of a treat. There's definitely going to be no flavor fatigue and there is absolutely going to be 100% pure f delicious satisfaction. Um, so New South is actually a food truck. You got the roll with all the images of crab on it, crispy onions. It tastes like I'm eating sushi, and it's not a bad thing. Which obviously definitely follow them on their social media and you'll be able to find them all around Huntsville. Um, I would definitely go check them out. They were here like again at this little uh, food uh, truck festival here which was freaking awesome. That's where I caught them. However, again, they are all around kind of the city. And like I said, just check out their social, which will be down in the description below, to find their location. Um, they do normally frequent locations. Like I said, they frequented this uh, kind of food truck event every week, which was awesome. And uh, like I said, the rest is other info is on the, uh, just in the in the description on their social media. Carolina dog. Oh yeah. Full slot mustard and chili. With that spicy Nate's hot dog, just great combo. Besides that, I believe it's pretty straightforward. Like I said, we're in the quest of that free meal. Um, again, I can't speak enough to the absolute delicious flavors of this challenge. But ultimately, I will say, Huntsville, you are blessed with some awesome hot dogs. Definitely go check them out. And that, uh, that's about it. So how about we get to the rest of the video? And uh, I mean, hey, I, you know, it, it's, I guess I'll just put it this way. Comment again down below, guys. Like that video and let me know which hot dog you think is my favorite. And uh, at that, let's see if we can even finish and get to them all. So with that, let's get to the rest of the video. Last but not least, we have the biggest hot dog, which has the pulled pork on it. Looks very, very fantastic. I love barbecue. Here we are, guys, Alabama. Oh, yeah.
And even the pulled pork is fantastic. The barbecue sauce and coleslaw, that's definitely a keeper. All right, last but not least, we have the roll here. I don't think I have a fork, so as suiting, we'll just use our hands here. I do like sushi. Got some ginger, spicy crab roll, all the beautiful sauces on there as well. This is a deep fried roll. that we are done. All right, 842 just finished up, guys. That was absolutely delicious. So, so, so delicious. I think those are probably the best hot dogs I've had in like, if not ever, a super, super, super long time. I love a Nathan's hot dog. You just can't beat it. They're using the huge quarter pound dogs, which are absolutely giant. What else I will say is just the flavors, the combinations were so unique. I loved, loved, loved the one with the pulled pork on it. It was absolutely fantastic, guys. That little bit of mustard, that coleslaw. The actual pulled pork on that hot dog was fantastic. The mojito dog was actually life changing. I've never had a hot dog like that. Would totally recommend everything. I mean, the Chicago dog was just a classic. It was amazing. I, I honestly can't say enough. Sushi roll was great, but uh, super impressed with the hot dogs. So you guys, if you're ever in Huntsville, definitely, like I said, definitely got to stop on by. You can follow the truck um, on their social media. They do have different locations. They go around, but they're open pretty much every day of the week. So, would definitely recommend you guys stop on by. Great food, great place. The hospitality's been fantastic. And uh, that's about it. So, we're looking for great hot dogs, just a great spot. Um, they're also at this like really cool food truck rally every uh, Wednesday night. So, that's where we are today. So, that'll be one, that's about it. So, just have a lovely day, have a lovely life. This was freaking amazing. I didn't know I was gonna have such amazing hot dogs in Alabama. But here we are today. So, that everyone, like I said, appreciate you and uh, that's about it. It's the happy, healthy, hungry, happy eating. And honestly, maybe don't eat all of these in one sitting, but definitely grab yourself one of these dogs. They're freaking amazing. So, until next time, everybody. And everyone, we are in Chattanooga County. Yes, so not Chattanooga, Tennessee. That is a little further north, but Chattanooga County in Georgia. Uh, so we're on our way from uh, basically Atlanta to Huntsville, Alabama, and uh, we're going through some of this great vast countryside. I wasn't sure what kind of a drive this was going to be, whether it was going to be, you know, some uh, big highways, two-lane highways. Turns out it's some smaller two-lane highways giving us a bit of a ride through the countryside. No complaints. We get to see some great big green masses of trees and or now we're getting into I, I don't know I, like I'll call them hills like if you kind of see straight ahead I don't know if that's technically a mountain and I've never really actually been to uh, far east Tennessee where you do have the Smoky Mountains you have kind of the ranges and stuff but maybe we will get to kind of see a little bit of the uh, I don't know maybe we'll get some cool scenery but nonetheless Chattanooga County and some more of the beautiful countryside. We have been going kind of through some mountains, a little bit of a, a little bit of windy road. I, I mean, maybe mountains is not the right term, but kind of mountains, kind of like the green, uh, you know, tree covered ish mountains. Uh, they're probably mountains uh, that we kind of highlight a little bit earlier. But yeah, definitely a big ride through the countryside. Um, yeah, so pretty good. We did just officially enter Alabama. So I'm not sure technically what uh, area of Alabama we are in, but we are technically in Alabama. But nonetheless, still this very, very beautiful greenery. I like it. 
So here we are, we're getting uh, into uh, Huntsville area, we're about 30 minutes away. There's definitely some great big um, hilly Ganmore mountain tree thingy things around. Um, so that's, again, it, it's, it has been a very, you know, dirty windshield, but a very pleasant, pleasant drive. Uh, it's been a very beautiful day. You know, they call this God's country. Um, it's gorgeous. You know, re it really has been a beautiful drive. Very, very uh, gorgeous scenery. It, it's really cool, you know, and, and it's been quite peaceful. Um, like I said, there's been some windy roads up and down going, you know, kind of through some of these, uh, again, I don't know if you call them hills, mountains, whatever you are, these big tree thingy things. There's more again ahead of us. There you go. So yeah, pretty cool. So beautiful drive, guys, in the area of Huntsville, Alabama. Hey, guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And at that, thank you so much. You rock.